quarter. The game turned when the Giants won the coin flip. <laughs> Collins, the well-dressed Amani Toomer, missed a couple of days of practice, doesn't look like it here, 16 yards. Collins, play action. Oh, and the fire, the Giants, you know they're going to come out running, right, Tom? Wrong. Toomer, 10 yards out of bounds. Collins, I kill your Keith Thibodeau on the Thibodeaux. Can't get him. I kill your touchdown. G-Man, 7-0. While LT and the Giants look on, it couldn't get any better than this. Mo Williams, Troy Walters, it's a loose ball. Mo, Larry, Curley, they all fumble it. Lyle West is on there for the Giants. Next play from the 18, and you go for the jugular. Collins to Greg Camella. We've been talking about that Collins Camella combination all year long. 14 0. G Man. Great play call on the shooting up. You're going to see Dwayne Rudd in coverage right there. Arrows. Uh, trouble keeping his footing right there around the 10 yard line. Camilla, nice catch. Good footwork. Still first quarter on their own what? One? Collins. Two. Tom, is there a Viking playing <laughs> pass defense? Where are they? Three plays later, third and 13. Is there a Viking play? Well, let's play prevent defense to give him 20 yards. Collins to Hilliard, 15 yards. Look at Kerry Collins. A bit of bad luck here as the ball is tipped at the line by a Viking, Hoban. Off the face mask of Ron Dane. And here comes Minnesota, the turning point of the game. Robert Tate has the interception. As you said, Hoban gets the tip at the line of scrimmage. Ron Dane lost track of the football, hits him in the helmet right there. And Tate with a fairly easy interception. And you thought this might be a turning point for the Vikings. Some of the great giants like Kelsey introduced before the game. And so he's trying to inspire his defense, and boy, were they inspired. Dante Culpepper looking for Chris Carter. Emmanuel McDaniel with a big pick of the end zone. G-Man defense. And what a great playoff Michael Strahan is having, working against Corey Stringer right here. Look at the power rush, throws him off at the end, and that pressure helped cause the pick in the end zone. Well, he did it to Runyon last week. He did to Stringer today. And here's more defense. Yes, yeah, Cedric Jones coming around the corner on Culpepper. Michael Strahan coming from the top of the screen. Just beats Corey Stringer around that corner. Boy, the defense was fired up for the Giants. Michael Barrow right there. And LT applauding the D. Later in the second, it's the offense of the Giants. And what an offense this was. Collins. To Ron Dixon, who had that big kick return last week. Oh, what a catch he makes. 44 yards. Two plays later. Another giant back at the wideout. It's that famed Collins to Joe Jurevicious combination. That's beautiful. Fernando Smith couldn't catch Collins. 24 to nothing. G-Man. Good play coming from all areas defensively. Jason Seahorn on Randy Moss out in the flat. Limits the yardage there, four or five yard gain. Two plays later, third and one. Watch John Davis and watch the smack right there by Dave Thomas. Dave Thomas, Rick Moranis, the McKenzie brothers, all of them <laughs> playing defense. And it's for the Viking offense, what? They watched and they watched the Giants play offense. Collins to Ike Hilliard, who had an unbelievable day. 10 catches for Hilliard, that was 28 yards. Collins, Hilliard, touchdown before the half. The lay-in, 34 nothing. G-Man! In the third quarter after a Culpepper fumble on the first play, Collins to Monty Toomer. He's going to spike it, though his hands are so good. It's 41 nothing. G-Man! Harry Carson, Wellington Mara, the classy owner. No Hines! <laughs> All the Hall of Famers are there. For Chris Carter, Randy Moss, stunning. Jim Fossil, wet. 7-0 since he said we're going places. And look at Jesse Armstead. Remember, they battled a year ago. And look at them arm in arm. Kerry Collins. We'll get to his numbers in a moment because he was absolutely fantastic. But we'll get to him now. Five touchdown passes, 28 of 39 for 381. Two quarterbacks in postseason play. LaMonica and Steve Young have had six touchdown passes. Collins joins one of five now that's had five in postseason play.